going to do a puzzle. This one. I don't know how well it focuses. But this is called Cosmos. It's a thousand pieces. Claiming to be premium quality. We'll see. I haven't tried it yet. And it's from Treffle. And the size is... Well, 68.3 times 48 centimeters. And the copyright is Adrian Chesterman. And it's made in Poland. And I have never done anything like it, so I'm really excited. And I have a feeling it's gonna be also really hard, so I have no idea how long this is gonna take me, but you know. The beauty of watching it in a video is be I speed up a lot of the process and you don't even see a lot of the process or you don't see a lot. You see a lot of the process, but you don't see everything. But anyway, Cosmos is today's puzzle for this video. So let's get into it. I'm trying something different with my filming this time. I don't know if it's going to work or not. Fingers crossed that it does. So, yeah, you'll get to see me do this puzzle. Regular piece shapes, rather thin pieces, very, very thin pieces. I have sorted the edge pieces and, well, the rest. There are so many different colors, so it was hard to pick someone to sort because they're all mixed together. some more sorting and I found the last edge piece. I have everything, yellow, edges of different kinds or very specific markings in a way, and blue. first day 
because I can't sit too long at the same time. But, I mean, the edge is done. I put some things together. So now, I'm gonna start with my second day. puzzle is about to start. And this is how far I've come at the moment. So let the puzzling commence. Is that the right word? I don't know. I hope so. Why do I always do that to myself? Leave the hardest part to the end? Well, that's how I've always done puzzles. But let's continue.
then the stars in the middle here and some of the dark parts over here were so hard. I spent quite some time on this puzzle. Uh, but I really enjoyed it. Let's check if it sticks together. Yeah, fairly well. And apparently that was the last you could see of it when it was still whole. So yeah, uh, the pieces lock together somewhat well, but if you try to lift it too much, it will fall apart, apparently. And so, because I wrote it down, I can't help it. I spent a total of 7 hours and 20 minutes on this puzzle. And yeah, I sorted twice. First, just the edge pieces and then a little bit with the colors. I spent whole, a whole 50 minutes on the edge. Not quite sure why, but I did. But yeah, the total was 7 hours and 20 minutes, and I'm not that good in quick math. 20 minutes, I spent... Alright. I don't know if my math is fully correct, but if you take away doing the edge and the sorting, I spent 5 hours and 55 minutes on the actual puzzle. I really liked it, but... As you just saw, even though the pieces stick together fairly well, not completely when you try to lift it just in one corner, obviously. But it was fun, and yeah, I really enjoyed it. It looks like there's a piece missing now, I'm sure it's just, yeah, it's right under here. You can't see it. Anyway. You've seen me do the puzzle and you've seen it starting to fall apart and now I'm going to put it back in a box and do something else. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoy doing puzzles if that is something you enjoy. And I will see you in the next video.